Hello and welcome back. I had about half an hour to spare and I was thinking that this game really deserved a little bit of time. So I'm just going to jump in and do a quick mission. Igor! Igor! I need you. I need you now. Uh, Tanya? Meet me in the Pripyat residential area. Just gonna check my inventory and stuff. It's been almost two weeks since I played this, so I'm not even sure where I'm at here. Just gonna sign Olivier to that one because it's an 86% chance, so he should be successful, but I'm not gonna do the mission she just asked me to do. I just wanna get rid of this one. Duga, a huge frightening monstrosity made of steel. The epitome of the Cold War and insatiable ambition. But what does it have to do with you or me? It's been so many years, but someone must remember Igor. Someone has to know. I've missed this game. I hope the recording does it justice because it's really a nice game to play. Nice to look at. Really good story to it. Some odd characters, but every game probably has that anyway. What the hell? It doesn't look good, huh? How did this happen? Those things attacked us. The last one got to me. I blew its face off. And now I'm stuck here. By the way, can you spare a bullet? You want to kill yourself? I'm not stupid. I know I'm not getting out of this. At least... Let me end it. Before another one of those things shows up. Or kill me. At least you're a human. Wait, there must be some way to get you out of this. You're free to look for one. Just don't leave me hanging, huh? The way those lungs sound, I'm not sure if I'm going to be doing him a favor or not. be damned. I was sure I was a goner. <sighs> Thank you. Maybe be more careful from now on, hmm? I will. Listen, I'll, I'll remember your face. Uh, hopefully I can return the favor one day. Hopefully that makes up for popping that guy in the other episode.
keep expecting those creepy dolls to do something. Probably shouldn't shoot these guys all the time, but if I save them when I have an opportunity, maybe it'll like balance out. Just gotta drink some alcohol and you forget all about shooting them. Can't sleep, my love. Are you worried about tomorrow's exams? I've got a feeling something terrible is going to happen. I'm scared, Igor. Hey, everything's going to be fine. Dr. Petrovich is one of the best gynecologists in the country. And we're in this together, remember? I hope you don't come to regret that, my love.
I was waiting for it to end, but I think all I had to do was step past it. I really need to start making lockpicks. Sounds like a rave in the radiation zone. Stop right there! You're on Pripyat Bradfa turf now! I'm... what? Where? Bradfa! Pripyat Bradfa! You must be new here, huh? A tourist? What's your name? Yeah, I'm a tourist. My name is Igor. 
Well, what's going on? Bratva runs this place. That's what's going on. Pripyat Bratva. And you will obey the rules, Igor the tourist. Uh, what is this? Bratva? Bratva is Sasha, Grisha, Oleg, Vova, and Aloysia. And Evgeny. Interesting. And where are all these guys? Let me think. Uh, Sasha got arrested. Grisha was shot. Uh, Oleg fell to his death. Vova drowned. Aloysia overdosed. Only Evgeny is left. And I take it that Evgeny is you? Evgeny is me. I'm the last man standing. I'm the Pripyat Bratva now. I made the rules, you got it, tourist? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. You make the rules. Good. I like you already. Just remember the number one rule. Don't fuck with us. Nobody fucks with Bratva, tourist or no. You know, you listen pretty well. I've decided to let you join our gang. You can be my second in command. Oh, it's an honor. Thank you. You mentioned something about trade. What kind of things do you have? I don't know. <laughs> what do you mean, you don't know? Duh. I sell boxes of loot. I never open them, so I don't know what's in them. Well, that doesn't make any sense. Each box is totally random? Duh. My loot boxes are like a box of chocolates. You never know what you're gonna get. <laughs> That's deep. I know. Ksenia told me I was the biggest fasologier in our neighborhood. It's very simple. One food ration for one box of loot. One box a day. Igor, we just met, but I feel like I've known you for years. You're like a brother to me now. Have a free box of loot on me. But don't tell anyone. It's a secret. A broad for secret. You can help me, friend. I'm looking for a woman. Her name's Tatyana Amelieva. Tatiana? Ah, a beautiful name. She sounds like a beautiful woman. Tell me, you have some photos? Uh, uh no. No, I, I had one, but, uh... Ah, uh, too bad. I've never heard of her. She's your woman, right? <laughs> ah, love. I was in love once, Ksenia. Oh, what a woman she was. She promised to cut my balls off if I ever betrayed her. <laughs> and did she? What a funny guy you are. <laughs> I already like you. Nah, she didn't. She dumped me. But she said I was too smart for her. Uh, so, uh, anything interesting going on around here lately? Well, there's something fishy happening in the power plant. Those NAR fuckers have been running around like crazy lately. And there's this creepy fuck with a black mask hunting for something. Whatever it is, it's bad for business. He leaves me alone, but he scares my customers. So you do have other customers? What did I just say? That fucker's been scaring him away. If it wasn't for him, this place would be busier than the Ismailovsky market. I better be going now. Bradfa forever, Igor! Yeah, I don't think this place would be that busy.
I think that objective is stuck behind that locked door. You came to finish the job, you bastard! What the hell happened here? Uh, use your eyes, genius! God, that goddamn creature from hell got the drop on us! Here. This should get you back on your feet. Thank you. I won't forget this. Finish my contract, I'm going to grow a beard. Chicks in Moscow dig beards.
a dull boy. Guys, we've got a situation here. I don't think backup's coming. HQ, I found a dead body. It's one of ours. This is the same music box I gave to Chana for her birthday. What's this? There's something clipped to the inside. Is this a bug? So, Tachana was under KGB surveillance. Why? What did they want with her? Why did you come here? Recognize it. You wanted to talk. Let's talk. Not with me. The old fella wanted you to see this first. You're running out of time. How did you get it? Not here. Meet me in the building next door in a couple of minutes. This just keeps getting better and better. I don't think it's the building next door, but I have a feeling where that radio was. It looked like it was more important than just a radio sitting there. Took you so long. Did the tiny dancer get your attention? <laughs> Old man said it would. He's gotta test you before he decides if he likes you. Every fucking thing is a test with that crumbling fruitcake. But at least he pays well. Are you going to explain to me what this is all about? Captain Spastic said you'd recognize a big fucking radar assembly and that it means something to you. Then he mumbled something about the Rat King and the end of the world, but I don't think he was serious about that part. I came here to talk to the old man, not his errand boy. I'm going back. The fuck you say? You're a lucky son of a bitch, I'd mess you up. But then I wouldn't get paid. Now shut your fucking face and pay attention when your betters are talking. You got a choice to make. It's easy. You can either use the detonator to blow this metal monstrosity to kingdom come, or you can use the other thingy to upgrade your PDA. That will improve the functionality of every scanner in the network. Why do I have to choose? Don't know. Don't care. I did my fucking job. Now you do yours. And who the hell are you supposed to be? I'm a man on a job, that's all. Yeah? That's all you need to know, friendo. Last piece of advice. This guy is crazy loco, sure. But there's always some kind of reason behind what he's doing. So, ask yourself, why would he want you to make this choice? I kind of want to blow up the radar, but I think I'll take the PDA. So, what does it do?
Okay, I'm probably just going to dish out some food here, and then I'll go take care of my inventory. But that was a pretty fun little mission. Anyways, I'm going to wrap it up here. And thank you for watching.